before we start this video, I have to give out three massive shout outs. Shout out to Nadine, Adam and Nat Moss for becoming my newest patrons. Thank you so, so much guys. You have no idea how much that can really help benefit the collection and the channel. So big shout out to you guys. Let's get on with this video. Hello and welcome back to Bug Realms. On this channel we like to discuss all things creepy crawly so if that's something that interests you please consider subscribing to the channel. So just to give you an update, next week fingers crossed should be the relaunch along with the giveaway so make sure you've hit that bell notification icon next to the subscribe so it notifies you as soon as that video goes up because you don't want to miss a chance on winning that giveaway. It is worldwide as well. So in my Western Invert Show rehousing, you would have noticed I didn't feature my Bumba Kabokla sling that I picked up from Tarantulas Online at the Western Invert Show. Well, originally I was going to keep that Bumba Kabokla in the tub it came in because it's still a small sling and it would have done fine for a molt or two. I tell you what, I came across these in my local pet shop. Cool little acrylic enclosures, perfectly see-through with a magnetic lid top. Now this one doesn't actually contain my Bumbuka Bokla, it contains my H. Polcripes or H. Polcripes, however you'd like to say it, the Golden Blue Leg Baboon. Let's have a look at some footage of that now. What a beautiful spider, right? But I also decided, you know what? I love my little Bumba Kabokla and I wanted to put it into one of these too. So I did so off the camera. I was gonna try and collect a few of these and put my slings in them. I didn't even think about recording it. But then I woke up for work one day and I thought I'm gonna check on all my spiders as I do most mornings. And I looked in and he had flipped. He'd only been in this acrylic enclosure a few days, must have been comfortable in there, flipped over, ready for its molt. And I managed to catch the whole thing on camera in a time lapse. So let's check that out right now. Gotta admit that was pretty cool, right? So we can't feature that Bumba Kabokla in a feeding clip or anything today because it is freshly malted and you never want to feed your tarantula straight after a malt because it needs time for its fangs to harden. And if you want a size comparison, this is the malt. This teeny tiny little speck here was our Bumba Kabokla malt. So there's nothing else to discuss in today's video. Everything should be back to normal as of next week. Remember to hit that bell icon as I suggested earlier so you do not miss my future uploads including the one with the giveaway. I can't wait to see you next week and show you what I have done with the new space. Thanks for watching guys, take care, bye bye.